All right. Yeah, I'm just waiting for the electricity rates to... Uh, I shouldn't say... Be, I should stop doing that. Uh, as in, no, because what I should be saying is uh, while the electricity rates are sky high, I'm doing things that are not related to um, using electricity from the house. I guess that's the way to look at it because I have to stop thinking that... Um, I'm waiting for it to kick in so why I can go to the internet and so on and so forth. No, I have other things to do. And that's why I think in a lot of ways I can get lots of things done. Because while the electricity things, I'm not on the internet, I'm not checking, like there's none of that. I'm just doing, you know, counters or whatever. But uh, so here, um, hopefully it's not too um, herky-jerky. Yeah, I'm just getting ready for uh, the Saturday live stream and um, putting out these little markers to show where the um, the starting positions are for um, um, the second battle of Ypres and uh, Artois, as it's called in the um, Western Front de Valkrieg um, module. So this is the scenario specific uh, thing and I was setting it up and I wanted to use it small enough so that way we can later on uh, take a look and start seeing some of the, uh, the names. Hold on, I actually have to get my reading glasses. All right, back again. So, yeah, I wanted to make sure that we could, you know, start seeing not all of them, but at least be able to start seeing some, like, there's Cambrai. And uh, just be able to, and there's, um, well, there's Ypres. So we can see, and also I'm starting to clue in, well, we'll talk about it later, but, uh, like, on the Saturday live stream. But there, on a side note as well, like, it's just neat to also start seeing things like, where's Soissons? I was like, ooh, cool. Like, I just didn't, there it is. And also, for me, you got to remember, I, I guarantee you, uh, every single viewer out there knows more about the Western Front than I do. Um, uh, for me, it, it, this has like been a sideshow. It's just this, uh, you know, oh yeah, that's been going on as well kind of thing because I've been so focused on the on the Eastern Front. And I've missed lots of, you know, once I started doing the week-to-week -week thing, I, you know, and the way it's going, I've missed like the Miracle on the Marne stuff and all that, uh, whatever. So I don't know any of the, like it's, you know, I'll eventually find out about it but what I I guess this is just a side bonus uh when I wanted to start doing this thing here when I was like the week to week thing and I was like hey why not try to incorporate like take a look at what was going on with uh if there's any you know scenario specific uh any scenarios that uh, start um you know at a certain point when you're talking about it in the week to week things and that's how it started with the second battle Yip, and we're going to go on and on and on hold on I'm going to show you so yeah, so I, I mean, some of you guys know about this. So I have this on my wall, so that way for 1915, and then day by day, I'm using the black button. So in my universe, you know, it's, uh, you know, it's April 19th, 1915, it's a Monday. And um, so I know that on, on Thursday, which is our Saturday, uh, that's going to be the first battle, uh, that's going to be the opening, uh, well, the, the, uh, the second battle of uh, Ypres is going to start there. And... On and on and on. We've got some other stuff. Uh, hold on, I'll try to go slowly. See, I just color coded so that way later on we can go. But here's the in like I said, here's the neato thing. Hold on, we'll go back to the crazy map. Yeah, you know, like for example, I had no idea how far in Germany, um, uh, you know, was able to push into France. I had no no clue they were this far in. Like it's so things are starting to make a lot more context for me. And uh, I've still, you know, oh my God, I'm only at the beginning of 1915, so this is totally cool. Um, and that was the side note, uh, a side benefit of doing this. And yet again, I was starting to get worried. Well, not worried, but I was like, oh gosh, you're just turning into a World War One live stream every Saturday. But no, especially when it pops into this stuff, and then I can start trying to incorporate and start seeing um, what um, this Der Weltkrieg scenario for the Second Battle of Ypres and Artois, what does it differ, like, historically in the sense of, okay, he's calling it this, but the second battle of Ypres was not way the hell over down here. You know what I mean? It was way the heck over here. It was just this. So it's a different scale. So is that why he added in the and Artois, uh, that type of stuff? But we'll talk about that on Saturday. But uh, it's, yet again, like I'm just saying, like, wow, it's, what a side... Um, Beautiful side benefit to all of this stuff. Sorry about the herky-jerky. That's just the way it is. Uh, and, uh, yeah, probably more stuff I could have talked about, but whatever. Okay, um, hope you had a good day. See ya.